you're getting lots of water, aren't you, buddy? How about you, big fella? Who's a good, who's a good boy? Lots of water today. Wow, the pond is overflowing. Unbelievable amounts of water down here, guys. First time I've seen this much water. It is uh, an emergency at the mine site right now. Hurricane Ida has just come through. It is absolutely insane. Turn around, look at this. This is the mine site, guys. This is where good old lads digging happens. And look at the water. The bridge is out. Everything is overflowing. The amount of water, there's our drainage pipe over there. It's actually being ripped out. That's actually where I just put in some uh, a floater for our three uh, pumps. You'll see that the whole bridge is washed out. Water flowing throughout the mine site. This is complete catastrophic destruction. I can't even get on here without the fear of this floating away on me. <clears throat> Do we even try it? Holy shit, this water is as almost as high as I am. Thank God I put a whole bunch of boulders in underneath here. There is a lot of boulders and rocks under here and I had backfilled it with sand several times. I got all the stuff out of here that I'm worried about. This is up on a higher platform. If this floods out, no big deal, but we're having pretty good drainage right over here. There's a drain under here, which makes me fear what's going on. This is all under here is gonna be hollow, no matter where I go. And getting back across is going to be treacherous, to say the least. So I gotta get across this friggin' sand hill and hop my way across there. It's hollow under here. Here we go, wrapping the camera around me. Look at the white water here. That is just balancing, guys. Please don't wash out. Please don't wash out. Well, we'll just let nature take its course now. Ah, uh, I gotta tell ya. Oh, yes! There's one right after the other. Black beauties. Oh. Awesome! <laughs> You're definitely a part of the crew. Good morning, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I base my first scale build off of. Dude, you've got kit. That is dope. <laughs> Welcome. And you brought Troy with you. You were cool right up until Troy was with you, but that's awesome. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Did you find him at the bus stop? Did I what? Did you find Troy at the bus stop? Yeah. Oh, that's nice of you to give him a ride. I know. Let me help you out here. Mr. Boom. Good morning. Good morning. You? Welcome back to the mine site. Mr. Troy, thank you for coming back, even though it's been shitty and raining all week. Uh, Jason, sir, how are you? Not too bad. How are you? you? Everybody wants to know. You, you are brand new to mining. Brand new. You're being thrown to the wolves today. Yep. Good. And how far did you drive to come be with us and hang out? About two hours. Thank you very much. One direction. <laughs> Mr. Mike? Good we're day. All, we're all inside now looking at us. Hey, gold! Gold! Yeah, see, Jason knows already. He, I know. He came driving kit. He's in already. That's just the way it goes. All we got to do now is pop his cherry. Oh. Skip to oh, the my I see water level high. Holy Ooh. snapping assholes. Wow. No! Fucking <gasps> Wow, talk about a serious washing. Oh my! Holy fucking hell. Oh, this is not cool. 
Jason, Damn, Jason's hurricane. never seen this place yet. And he comes to it like this. Yeah, it's fucked up. It's balancing, Mike. It's balancing. I was able to get in during the storm and move a lot of the shit out of the way. Yep. That's kind of what we whoa. expected. Just leave it there. Look at it. Just fucking wiped out everything. All of it's wiped out. There's a leak under here. All this is hollow. This all sank in. This got worse. Oh my god. So I moved it out of the way. All the banks oh, here fell apart. Don't go down again. Listen. You signed the... Uh, you fell last time, man. Yeah. I got the waiver from it's you. It's Mike's turn to fall next time. Oh man. Jason, you signed the waiver? Yes, I did. Okay, good. X. This is insane. Yeah, it's serious damage, guys. Oh my god. Yeah. Wow. Uh, did yeah. we lose any pay? Uh, it's all pie. washed. Did we lose? Oh my god, we lost all the pay. Look at, look at it. Well, it's not all the pay. It's still there's still gold in there, but it's got fucking peppered. Look at this. Gold right there. There. Yeah, there's still gold in there. But not a lot. But it, wow. yeah, it, it, it got hammered. Have, it got hammered. Have to it. Look at this float was completely off. Like it, it, I see it that. almost floated away. In fact, the pipe was bending up. I did put the, the pumps on a float, so we got all three pumps out there. And nice. I did build a wash bar for the trommel so we can wash all the dirt in there. I didn't want to tell you that. I, was, I did this before the hurricane. And then we get nailed. And then, and then we, we got then nailed. it gets devastated. We're going to have to oh, rebuild. Oh, that looks awesome. Yeah, it washes. I didn't, it was supposed to be a big surprise. Hey! Mm. Oh, crap. Surprise, move some dirt. Yeah, look wow. at, even the hoses are like... Washed away. Oh my god, that pit was that hole was yep. huge. Yep. So that's where we're at. So three steps forward, two steps back, I guess. Uh no, I feel like we've gone fucking ten steps backward. The whole mine site needs to be done. These guys are bitching and complaining that they're they're not getting enough yellow gold in the pan at the end of the day. How the fuck are we supposed to do that? Well when hurricanes hit, we can't. I think we it's fine. Can't. I think it's time for the BFDT. BFDT. Explain. The big fucking dump truck. <gasps> we need to bring out the big fucking dump truck. We gotta start filling this shit in, backfilling it. So we're gonna need the excavators and loaders down to, like we need to start backfilling this. And we need to make a new road. At least if we backfill a middle section of this, I don't need to do all of it, but build it back over. So I'm going to need guys bringing dirt. That's only like six or seven of the big dump trucks. We yeah, that dump that. truck fucking holds yeah. 250 pounds we of dirt. Build, we can't get it across that bridge. No, but I can bring it. We're going to have to bring it in the long way and go across the, the fucking hoses and then just start dumping and then get the loaders in there with the dozers and just start pushing it back and forth. So one of the issues is if you guys have ever watched like full size gold mining, uh, because everything here is basically a gold mine. It's just we're using smaller equipment and the yield is a lot smaller. Um, but at the same time, you cannot process wet dirt. You got to basically have generally drier sand and stuff to go through the grizzly bars or else it just clumps up on top and it's a wasted energy. So the only gold you guys are gonna get today is if we find any in the dirt, awesome, but it is a bunch of good old lads digging. Let's get to work, boys, yeah? Yeah! yeah. 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 Gold. Good job. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit of an awkward bugger, hey? It is. When you actually look at this on a show, can you tell how heavy it is Not in person? At all. How Not heavy at all. do you think this truck is? 50 pounds. 50 pounds. <laughs> 50 pounds. <laughs> Did, did the Sanuts actually hold up through the entire hurricane or are they soaked? One's <laughs> one stinky and soaked? One's soaked and one is not. Okay, right good. Right is soaked, left is not. Right Nothing on. Of I see Mr. Boom shirt is hanging up behind you. Is that drying out now? Can you Holy cast? Holy fuck! Are you sure it wasn't your Sanuts? Oh, no, man. My, my feet don't stink. Dude, your shirt got soaked. 
I gotta talk to the supervisor of his mine site. That's completely unsatisfactory. There's, there's no one supervising the mine site. This impact on my gear. Well, did you leave the door closed? No, it had to air out after last week. He didn't. He doesn't realize that uh, this is just your yard. You've lived here longer than I have, man. You know that hurricanes are a driving force, right? Jason's just shaking his hand, wondering what the fuck he <laughs> ended up coming here for with these crazy dudes. That's correct. I should have rung it out for a photo. Oh! <laughs> I like how you... <laughs> Look at the movement on When that. he laughs, it's like... Oh. <laughs> We've already been at this for several minutes and we haven't had a break. Uh, oh, coffee? Break time. Oh, no. Coffee? Break. Coffee's ready. Let's go. Coffee. Yeah, coffee, coffee time. Look Do you how far underneath Turtle Rock is. Yeah, I know, man. That's compared to what it was. Troy, I need you to come. Here, Jason, you're the new guy here. No, fuck Troy. Don't worry about it. Jason, Greenhorn's going to do it. Thank you. And uh -huh. one one more? Pfft, never. Thank you. That's plenty. There we go. And I'll also take one of oh, these. Help yourself, there. Jason, if you are so inclined. Oh, there you go. Oh. There it goes. Right. I, we were walking along the beach. Beautiful, sunny. I'm walking this way. She's walking that way. I look down and I go, no fucking way. I picked the bottle up. Cork in it message in it and a penny i opened it up it said this message is for fuck i can't remember his name it was a german guy he was off the canary islands that's where the bottle had come from the canary islands it was in 2011 we were there 2018 so yeah it was brilliant now there was an email address I dude email dude no. dude if you're telling a story like this you know the rules oh. you've got to be holding one of these at least okay, okay. you can't tell a story okay. if it's just okay, okay. if it's not even lit okay. that doesn't make sense i'm like what was the penny? Because it's a real lit story. Nice. Nice, nice. there, Dad. Nice. Thanks a lot. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Good dad joke. Good dad joke. I still I have it at home. I should bring it in. What, what was the story with the penny? Did it, did it say why you had a penny? Uh, maybe it was for the guy's thoughts, but uh, it was he wrote the message to one of his friends. Did this, I just fucking give you a joint and you put it in your, in your case and pulled out listen, one of yours? Listen, I'm low level... I'm working my way up. Oh, well, that's a compliment in some yeah. ways, I suppose. Oh, it is. He rolls them awfully tight and small. Here comes, boys! The BFTT! Yeah! This is two-wheel drive carrying, what, Troy's gotta be over 200 pounds. Nice, nice. Can you keep going? You're sliding. He's off track, he's losing it. Dude, you need to learn how to drive straight. Oh, we go around the, the stick, man. Yeah, oh, Whoa. man, you're not driving in a straight line. I'm stuck. <laughs> chains, bring the chains. Uh, no, you sit forward on that. You don't sit backwards. You're going to end up on your ass. Everyone will laugh hilariously, but you've had enough surgeries for anyone. <laughs> Hurry up. There's always another one. Are you in pain right now? No. Just disorganized. Here, take Dave. that. Right. My God. Here, hold this for a second. Do you even know? You got to hold it like this. There we go. One per. You got, I got that it. Even? I got it. There you go. Yeah, one per. Thank you. All right. Sir, you make sure on here. Let me get position. Lean back, Troy. Oh, oh, lean back, sir. Troy. Lean back. Come on. Troy, lean back, you drunk bastard. Pull, pull straight forward on the throttle, sir. Oh, throttle, throttle, throttle. Oh, Come on. All the way to the top. Nice! Nice job! That, if that didn't earn a light click, fuck them all. <laughs> Good job, dude. How's your knees? Hey there. For an old man? Fuck, man. Good job. You fucking muscled through it, boys. You, you actually muscled through it. Change! Yeah, thanks. Well, yeah. Troy, lean back, you drunk bastard. Big as a wheelbarrow? Bigger. Yeah? Wow, bigger. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah, only you got you got one on either side. 
There you go. Watch out now. Watch out. We can take a little cut out on the right here where these sticks are. Take a little cut out right there. Back the truck in like that and then just dump right in with the... Uh, Why don't we use a conveyor to actually load it? That's a better idea. Really? Conveyor? Wow. Yeah. Let's use a conveyor. Yeah. That's nice. Good. Yep. Okay, good. We got a consensus. This is a democracy around here, of isn't it? Of course it is, yes. Yeah, we, we always take exactly a vote on say. everything. All right, so will this one fit? It doesn't have any legs. We got to find the legs, I guess. You want that, uh, Listen, nice I have a conveyor that will work. I wasn't going to bring it out um, until a different day, um, okay. but I do have a conveyor that no one's seen yet. Oh, <gasps> uh, what? I brought in a mobile conveyor, but let's get it over to the guys first. Holy! Wait till I get it fully extended. It goes out again? Oh yeah. This thing's all hydraulic, man. Hydraulics. Hydraulics. And it's got wait, wait, it's got fucking it's got tracks, tracks on, it. on it. Mobile. Come on, let's Come go. Come on, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going. Fully extended. Damn. Oh my god, the rollers are. The rollers are what? The rollers are concave. Yes, they are. That's awesome. Oh, so that'll here. definitely get it into the back of the. That's Dude. almost enough to hold me wow. up. Wow. Too late, I did that joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but mine Look was better. Oh! Look at this. No! The grizzly yeah. bars are dumping. They're dumping now. You don't have to worry anymore. Oh. Auto dump grizzly bars. Yep. Holy Auto wow. dump all done right on the controller. Oh, nice. wow. Look at these doors. Oh, shit. Yeah, everything right here. Do the legs have to come down by themselves? Or? Nope, nope. They, can, they can come out okay. easy. That's just for it to be stable in one spot. That so we can control dead. it right here for the grizzly bars. Man, oh man. All right. And then just back and forth to let it down. And then for, you can shut down each one. And then if you run it the other way, so it's always, I put it on the dial. So if you pull down, it'll fold itself up. Right, come on in. That is sexy. Well, oh, it's even got a little rest for it too. Yes. Yep. Rubber pads. Yep. Wow. Correct. Yeah. Pretty cool, hey. So same up and, and down on the dials. Yeah. So this will help get dirt into the back. And this actually, you'll see that there's two motors up here because oh. it handles the tra the motors and transmissions actually are beefed up, so it actually handles the extra long load on here. Nice. Same. So it won't be pulling itself apart. Exactly. Such a nice unit, hey. Can you believe, bro, 5,000 Canadian dollars. Oh, absolutely. Yes, handmade, custom made in Vietnam. O only made when you order them and they'll make them how you want it. They asked me what color I wanted. I thought safety yellow because everyone always bitches about the safety, even though we don't care. We don't care. Mm. Oh, that's very, oh, I yes. like how we did that. Thank you. There you go. What is that super him, kind? Giving him back the one that you took earlier. That is so nice. Well, he knows what I like. That's the thing, right? The ones that's you a roll that's yourself. that is a good friend. Hey, 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 I got it. Oh yeah. Hey, this is RC show. We got to use everything RC, or they really bitch in the comment section. Even these tracks. This was all hand done. Beautiful. Lift up your boom yeah, lift it up. There nice. you go. Adjustable conveyor. Roll it in closer, please. Oh. Oh, I need you guys to move forward. We need to be digging right behind the conveyor here, guys. Everybody move forward. forward. Let's go. Let's go. We're burning time here. Full speed there. That is. <laughs> Have you ever run an excavator before? No. You are going to be a pro at this in about 10 minutes. Not a problem. Here we go. Come on over here, please. Perfect. Always turn on the radio before you ever do anything else, correct? Yep. Great, just making sure they're all in the right positions. Over here is the on off switch right here. See that fella? Yes, I do. Go ahead, turn it on. It's got three fuses. Doodle loop. Good, I don't have a driver in here. That's an issue. Uh -oh. Anybody? Oh, here, grab, grab, uh, grab uh, Big Joe from the excavator, the Hitachi. Yeah, right there, the cat. Yeah. Thank you. What's up, motherfucker? All right. Dude. Uh, here we go. Uh. Okay, he is done. You will see that the display there is actually functioning. It's telling you how much voltage you have Sweet. and the uh, amount of pressure you have in your hydraulics, all right? All right. Now, you will see that on the back there are two dials for your tracks. 
Yes. See these two right here? Yes, I do. Each one works that. Now that this, the pump is on, you can go ahead and use your sticks to figure out the direction. You can stand up. There you go. Yes, yep. First scoop. It's almost like you need to be a little higher, hey? Yeah, I think so. We need to build a ramp. I think so. Okay, ramp. Okay. We got some of it coming through. Okay, we got some coming in. Good. Never having used a hydraulic excavator before. There you go, Jason. Because it's a little bit... <laughs> Fail! Because it is too wet. Just leave it there, let it process for a second. It's still pushing it down. Jason, curl your bucket. There you go. Now push some down a little bit. There you go. For never having done this before, that's not too bad. Curl out, curl out, keep going. All right, it's painful to watch. Okay, back up. There you go. Dump it, Mr. Boom. This is a 60 kilogram machine. That's all right, there we go. She's heavy, that's unstable. Oh, look, I'm rolling the track. Oh, Whoa. look, the track's coming off. Okay, come in here. We're gonna have to roll this in right now. I had a loose track, I guess. Oh. Get on there, you bastard.
I see that you're very involved in the machines today. I am, I am. You are running the white Komatsu loader. I am running the white Komatsu loader. So what do you think of this conveyor system at the moment? Is it adequate? It's adequate for somebody that doesn't want to get anything done. I love that. That's honest. Uh, I love the honesty. Honest right there. Well, that's all we do here is be honest. What's oh, it yeah. like running that excavator oh, for the first time? It's fun. I, it's a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Yep. Is it a challenge? It is a little bit of a challenge, but after a while you get used to it. What is it that's challenging about it? Everything. Everything. <laughs> so a lot of people say you have to operate a machine uh, from the seat of your pants. This is clearly not the case this time, is it? No. Are you able to take full scoops yet? A little bit. Nice. So far, bit. so good. Oh, well, yeah. And what about you, Mr. Boom? I see that you are completely focused on what you're doing, and you are running the conveyor system. Is I, that correct? I always am. This is an amazing conveyor system. I love its flexibility. Yeah. yeah. Enough, enough, enough bullshit. What's going on with it? What do you do? It's doing? a little bit slow. It is slow, it is isn't a bit it? Slow. We could turn up the speed. I turned down the uh, I turned down the conveyor system itself uh, by changing the endpoints because I didn't want it running too quick. But I see the main problem today is that the dirt is way too wet and people can't even get it through the grizzly bars. Yeah. So if we had the bigger conveyor on here, it would definitely help. It would go so much faster with the bigger conveyor. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And Mr. Troy, you are running uh, the, the the big big boy the big boy today, yeah. The 970. Yeah, that's a, quite a massive machine. Do you find it's it's challenge to move a bucket that big compared to the other uh, excavator you're using? Or? It moves the same. It's just intimidating because of the size and how small everything else is. In comparison. Do you find do you find it more precision? Oh my God! It's where I put it. Where I want to put it is right where it goes. Nice. The only problem I'm seeing said. right now is we've been here for like an hour. Yeah. And look in the back of the big <laughs> dump truck because this is seriously an hour's work. This is what happens when you've got greenhorns running machines, though, right? We have to learn. Well, I just think that it's it's a beautiful excavator. Yeah. Excavator. Excavator. But it's just not big enough. <laughs> it's never big enough for the BFDT. <laughs> Maybe if we were filling up one of the other dump trucks, but not that Maybe. one. Uh, who's going to hit this uh, grizzly first? Fuck your grizzly bars, I'm moving on. I'm going to fucking just put it right on the bed. All three in the same hole at the same time? Wow, yeah. man. Three way. Three way. That's a dirty hole. Oh, I guess so. <laughs> oh, shit. That might be Looks a Looks like much. it was too much, eh? Thank you. What the fuck? That's what's going on. Overwhelmed. Okay, I see that the expensive one is not working out the way we needed it to because we've been digging all this time and got fuck all in there, guys. I think, oh man. I think we should try maybe back in the. Uh, Let's use the other conveyor. We have, we have to use yeah. the wider conveyor, guys. It's just, just there's just no brainer here. I mean, it is pouring in there good oh, now. It looks amazing. It oh. does look amazing. I think feeding it into the trommel is going to be absolutely perfect. Like that's the yes. right amount to feed into the trommel. And it's steady. And it exactly, brother. I nice like and that. Even flow, steady. Yeah. We got a quarter percent of that truck full. Uh, speaking of full, I'm rather empty. Mm. Now that we got the chains hooked up to the dozer, I think we should stop and have lunch. Lunch. Lunch time. Lunch time. Did you know that Mr. Boom is a smoking specialist? Really? Yes. Had no idea. I may not smoke the same stuff as these guys do, but what? I smoke oh, true. A bit of meat. You're you're you smoke meat. You smoke, I smoke meat. meat. Please Ooh, tell me it's that that's, came out the wrong we're going there. <sighs> it is that time again, mm. where we sit and feast upon the food. Mr. Boom brought us some great meat. Yes. Bacon wrapped hey. goodness. Hey. What? Hey. Can you show us and tell us what this is, sir? Bacon wrapped beef. My wife is like, well, open it open and they can't it. see it. What the fuck? I don't want to know, but we got to see it. It's smoked bacon oh, wrapped beef. Oh, smells so good. Mm. Stuffed. Absolutely delicious. Oh my god. If it this was so smell vision It looks like, I feel bad for me right now too, but it looks like a hamburger itself. It's just It does. Delicious. Bro, smell that. Uh, oh yeah. Dude, I've never enjoyed smelling another man's meat until today. <laughs> Have a sniff. Boy, <laughs> <laughs> come on. I'm right there with you, man. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> nice. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Mr. Well, Boom. I won't taste it, but I'll smell it. You won't taste it, you weirdo. What are you eating? What are you eating? What are you eating? 
I'm eating a... Uh, what are you eating? Tuna fish sandwich. What the fuck? Why are you eating that? Because I... Uh, Fail. Jeez. We're eating this then. Yum. Yummy. More for us. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I can't have any cheese. Fail on my part. And that's why I deliberately oh, didn't it. put cheese in this. Dude, bacon wrapped. Here you go. Thank you very much. Yeah. Very well, much. we work hard around here. We we work hard and we oh, eat yeah. hard. So yeah. We, we eat hearty. While we're eating meat, you noticed my hat? I did. What does my hat say? Camel towing. Yeah. <laughs> But then I'm blind as fuck. We'll pull it out when it's wedged in tight. <laughs> so now, who, turn off your pump there, Troy. I can hear it running. There we go. And can you turn down the sound system? Just turn down the dial. There you go. That shuts down that. So for you, Mr. Boom, uh, the side dials, could you please uh, pull down on your left hand dial? <laughs> yep, all the way. There we go. So because it's on a hydraulic ram, it's got control the whole time. Keep going, yeah. And then I want you to pull down on the other dial. All the way down, yeah, keep going. There we go. If you could push forward on your left track or left stick and pull back on your right stick. There you go, yeah. And keep going, keep going. The track's a little loose, it doesn't have a tensioner to it. Keep going, yes, man. Swing out more, you'll be able to get away from the BFDT. There you go, straight forward. Good job. Very it might awesome. be slow. Yeah, it's seriously awesome. We'll move this down to the uh, other side. Uh, we might as well fire up the dozers and get in that other uh, conveyor right now. Yeah, absolutely. Good job, dudes. Good, Good job, yep. Fucking slower this than molasses awesome. in January. It. It's slow, but that's awesome. Yeah, I'll have to put a track tensioner in there so we can get a track not so loose. One dozer can drag this along, no problem. So much action in one show. So much. All right, in place. You guys think this show is easy to do. <laughs> All right, boys. Good, we're bringing in the extra loader here. We need way more dirt. At 114 scale, this is almost a monster task just to even fill up this mining truck. We could need a bucket wheel excavator, uh, but they just don't make them. Over here, please, Troy. They don't really make them or drag lines. You can find them over in Sweden, but you don't find them over in the Western world. You gotta custom make that, and it's almost impossible to find. Same with a road grader. You can find plastic conversions, but anything that's a alloy or metal at all, it just doesn't happen. Good one, Troy. One after another. Let's get these uh, working in tandem. As one pulls out, the other pulls in. That's what she said. Okay, the only way we're gonna be able to do anything back here is backfill here. Yeah, if we can bring a dozer in, put it in here, then we'll dump a load and try to push it straight across. In fact, Mr. Boom, yeah. how's your back feeling, sir? Awesome. Let's drag this uh, plank up here and bring it straight across right. this plank. Can you do that? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's like I'm actually looking like I'm helping, but I didn't do shit. We'll just lay it straight across the top here, yep. right down to there. One end on there. Ooh, sure. Perfect, just like that. That way, when we backfill in right here with the truck, we can probably still make it straight across. We're supposed to do that with RCs. These guys are going to be complaining in the section, but we didn't do it with RCs. I'm what are you doing? Yeah, I'm an oh RC. Oh my god, you look like you're having arthritis. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everybody. Best I can say is we will uh, take it right out. All right. Back to the mine site. Let's fill this in. Gold! 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 Gold. Woo! Oh. Oh. Trying to pull this in. Because it weighs so much, the steering is extra challenging. You're, you're, don't, don't worry, what are you doing? You thinking you're gonna stop it? I would. No. <laughs> I think so. He'd catch it all right. Yeah. Here we go. All the way to the bottom, he'd catch it. 
This is all our hard work right here, boys. Gold! Yeah. We work hard for this. That's supposed to be there. That way it'll help fill it in. It's for drainage. There we go. That's nice. perfect. All right. That was totally worth it. A full day's work right there, gentlemen. Doesn't that make you feel fulfilled? I am so happy that we got that half done. <sighs> Mostly. Awesome. Almost awesome. all I the way. instant gratification. Right? That's what I'm looking for right there. So we need the bulldozer yep. just to start laying that flat, please. All and right. we'll get this giant truck out of here. And we need a loader to start uh, pushing the dirt around. So when you guys get the loader, I'm going to get the conveyor set up. I want to see dirt moving in the trauma, folks. Yeah. It's the end of the day. Fuck, you're strong. Boys, it's getting erect right now. Get your controller on. Yep. I think many of our viewers are also. Oh yeah, baby. Doesn't get any sexier than that. Okay. <laughs> Scale speed. Look at that! Yeah! Oh! Oh! Hold on, does it go any higher? It does not go any higher! It is slightly too high! The whole system is slightly too high! That sucks! I am not too high! That is what sucks about this! There you go, thank you! And we need to slide it over! There, yeah, that's good! Good job, gentlemen! No, we can drive it closer. Ah, problem solved. Hey! Hey, all we had to do was drive it closer. All right. Guys, hey. let's wash some dirt. This man needs some pay. Uh, anybody got pay? Oh, damn it. Should I push some of this up? I got, no, I got oh, that's right filler, here. man. That's not pay. You're right, that's just fill. Listen, we took all day to uh, get this much work in. These boys are tired after working most of the day. Uh, you know, the devastation. Philadelphia Phil here is ready for a cheeseburger. I am ready to go and smoke a fat one. And these guys know that the pay is too wet, so we can't really do any pay today. But we have it all set up, don't we, boys? Yep. Oh, yeah. Everything's Good ready to, to roll for the next episode of, uh, well, what is this show called? Gold. 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 Good Good old lad digging. digging. I saw plenty digging. of old dudes digging. digging today. Lads, does that even qualify for this old? Nobody has an idea of how much time it takes to get this much dirt with four, one fourteenth scale rigs to go into that hole. Yes. Or it's a whole lot of tiny little scoops. Yes. Tiny little scoops. Yeah. It's all about getting the dirt in the hole. It, it is the dirty hole. How much dirt is left in the hole? None. That's right. Because the hole's always empty. The hole's always empty. Wouldn't always. be a, wouldn't be a hole if it was filled, right? No. Hey. What are you doing? I was unhooking. We're all camera. We're all doing camera stuff right now. I didn't know that. Well, I'm letting well, you here, know. Let me give you, you know now. No, I can't do that one. We filled the can't hole. Can't do that one. Can't do hey, that one. I filled the hole. <laughs> ah!